We hinted in the previous video, and I might have actually just shown you uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. the boxes, but ignore that. Spoiler alert. <sighs> Spoilers, you know. This is the outset. Whoa! This is the this is the EC2 killer apparently. Supposedly the EC2 killer, um, which is my new Bay Mouse for many years uh, ab after the Death Adder. I still love me some Death Adder. It's just too big. Uh, it's, just, it's a big mouse. But it, in in the pinchy part where I where I pinchy pinchy it, yeah, it's just thinner on the EC2. And you know what? Yeah, I like that better. I think the better compromise if you like Death Adder was that the Mamba Wireless. That they came out with. Before. Or the new Death Adder is pretty nice. Too. The Death Adder V2 is good, but like the Mamba Wireless still. I don't know what yeah. it is about it. It's a nice shape. Great shape. You know what would be even better if I didn't want to spend three hundred dollars on the mouse? The Hyperflux. Hyperflux. Yeah, that would have been that would have been pretty dope. What you gonna do? I guess. I'm not spending three hundred dollars on a mouse pad that. Uh, apparently, those are having capacitor issues too. If you're one of the few people that actually inside the mouse. Yeah. Because it doesn't use a battery. It, yeah, uses, uh, it uses the capacitor, so it just charges up and discharges a bit. Yep, yep. They do the wireless and make it light. All right. How so, light was that, though? Not that light compared to the current mice. I was going to say, like, 88 is still pretty decent. I thought it was, like, 97 or something. The what? fact that that even has rubber grips yeah. makes it super heavy. All right. We'll so the, we have two dented. here. One's we got dented. One, we got one slightly dented. I mean, otherwise, packaging is pretty good. Well, Actually, let's open that one up first. Just okay, well, I sure. guess we're opening up the dented one first here. See what type of damage we're dealing with. I'm going to squeeze with the, with the Tuck XL. Not Yuppers. slicing his fingers. Yuppers. Um, so, oddly, these are not... I, I know these are white box. These are not glossy. These are these are the standard... Standard not glossy. The standard not glossy one. Alright, swing it around so you guys can okay. see it. Okay. And bam. Uh, oh, that is matte. She is that is like a matte finish now. They went to like is it a soft touch or no? Well, put your put your hand on there. That's that that's pretty close to a soft touch. Yeah. It's not. I wouldn't say it's like rubbery. The only, the only real drawback I could see to this. Fingerprints. Yes, and <laughs> the fact that the body is probably going to look like butts uh, after you sweat all over it, and then it literally. I think that is an improvement over the. Uh, grime. Yeah, I mean. It's, Better than the gray one. Oh, they, they changed have. it on here too, where they put the naming the outset right there. Yeah. And yeah, they don't have the. They move, remove the. Logo. And it's a two piece. Thing. Oh, they got this. The, the. Did the other one have the Vaxi icon underneath? Powered by. Uh, you put it over there. Yeah. Uh, oh, oh, oh! This one's damaged. Is it? Yep. You can see it right out of the box. Who? Giggity! Oh, I fixed it. Okay. Well. <laughs> Not good. Well, if we have issues with it, I'll, I'll contact them. You They're see. pretty good. You leave that one with me. Mm. You know, in case we run okay. into something with it. Hopefully the other one's not like I that. Doubt, I doubt we'll... I've had mice come like that before where, like, the button snap back. I'm pretty sure they said the middle button was better. On these okay, so on the white one... It does, okay. It does. On the black one... It does, okay. It does. I guess it's just been a while since I used the, uh, the Vaxi. Um, I like the change in logo. Though. We just cracked this open, the NP01G. I like, I like the logo change yeah, that the they had then. Yeah, where it's there yeah. instead of having it like on the palm. Under the palm, yeah. She's got a butt, man. She's got a big butt. Kinda. It definitely. Uh, where's where's that uh, EC2? Uh, it, uh, it's, over, it's there over there too. Here, put your hand on that guy. Can, just can man the man the camera. I don't know yeah, if I can actually. You gotta half press, and then see it'll put, put boxes open. Filters. I'll just uh, try to keep it here. Right. Look at that. There is the latest e in EC2 technology. Yeah, I'll let you have the camera back. Um, this is the camera. the latest EC2 here. The EC2, nothing else. Special edition white. Maybe something else over there too that we'll take a look at in a second. But uh, I mean, let me put my meat paw in here. Yeah, get that. Take hey, comparison. Uh, it will be my best. Feels a bit more hollow in the front. And try not to stick my fingers in the way and and pause this. Oh, they learned. They put the buttons completely. Yeah, higher up. You don't have to like completely hold. Like once you focus and you don't move the camera, you can like. I'm just it. trying to. 
but see how much tension needs to be. Here, pressed. look, I don't bump the front button. Yeah. And you know, and uh, melee people when I don't want to. Yeah. Instead of shooting them. Yeah. Instead of shooting them. Okay, this feels a lot like a. It's higher up. You should like this a lot. You can feel it. Okay, look at the. See how the EC2 goes down to the floor. Mm -hmm. This is not like a IME 3.0. Doesn't go all the way to the floor, like an IME 3.0. Mm -hmm. You should like this. Uh, I mean, you might. But, but I'm just on. saying that this fits your style of palm. Squares, squares palms like this. Ooga dooga. I don't know if I go like that. Ooga dooga. I go more like this. Let me just show you. All right. I just put my hand on there, and that's it. Yeah, but you generally have a higher up, for, more forward grip compared to me. I mean, I, if you look, it's basically just, I get in there. Yeah, see where his thumb is? It's just like to the middle of his thumb yeah. is like Which where the forward button is. I think that's just initially how it's there, because I don't think I hold it that way. I think at the end I end up getting a um, more relaxed. But, so what I, what, I, what I generally call that is like a top palm grip. Where you take your hand and you, you put it on, on top of it. It's definitely... See how you're... And also the palm of your hand, the base of your hand is actually a little bit off the pad. Yeah. Whereas if you grip like I do, I call it back or a rear palm grip. Yeah. Grab it from the b behind. Yeah. And generally your your bottom of your palm is on... Yeah, you're, more like, you're more like this, basically. I mean, if you look how I... Yeah, yeah that, that'd that, be a fingertip grip. Yeah, yeah, I can't do that. But but how much but then you got yeah, you no. got to palm it. Yeah, I have to do that. Yeah. Well, that's what I mean. Is like I have what is it? Like because sometimes I do play just wrist. Yeah. So that's that's common to fingertip grip is yeah. playing just just wrist, which would be like this. That's fingertip grip, right? But what I do is I I choke up on her even more. Yeah. So I have like a palm fingertip hybrid. Not a yeah, most people have a really, claw fingertip hybrid. You can't really palm this guy here. Nope. Not at all, really. But you kind of can't be of small hands. Let's. But it's not situated. Here's the like NP01. Yeah. Against the AX. Um, you can see finish wise. Yeah. You can see the NP01 is quite glossy comparatively. This is like a matte. I would say it's it's not even like a, a it's not a soft touch. Like the buttons. You see how the buttons seem more glossy now compared to the old yep. one? It's like they have this coating on here almost, and then these are a little more subdued and matte. I'd say these are the old ones are rougher. Yeah, than these guys right here. The, yeah, the, yeah, these are a bit slicker. The ones on the new um, outset. I wonder if it's like this too. Take a look there and compare it since. No, they're, they're even shinier than even the. So the MP01G has basically the same front as the MP01. Yeah. Um, these clicks, and they're they're definitely more hollow. Yeah. Well, let me crack open the other one. Maybe that's just like a an issue. Yeah, because you might have got one that had goofiness to it. I will say pre-travel, barely any. Post-travel, there is a little. Let's hope uh, that this button isn't all popped out too. <laughs> But, I mean, like, realistically, the vaccine mice have been the best so far, click-wise, I have ever, and scroll-wise. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Listen to that. Yeah, this one's... This one's better. Oh, uh, the dented box. No, it still sounds pretty... Yeah, it's just... You can hear it. That's how they make them light, dude, is you... You don't put anything in them. The wheel, though... This one's better. There's a bit more tension on these, I think, yeah. on the newer. Well, I don't know. Yeah, maybe. It's hard to say. If you go back to that one, use it for a little bit, and you can back it. Almost feels like pretty even. I think the rubber on the MP01G is a little softer yeah. on the scroll wheel. Yeah. Back and into. I feel like the scroll wheel is a bit tighter. It's also lower on the on the. You can uh, see it, like if you look. Yes, they they put it more in the mouse, right? Yeah. Yes, they mentioned that in I don't know if it was video or Twitter, but remember how I was complaining about that with the uh, like the OG EC two, like A, EC two A. Yeah. The scroll the stuck up so out. yeah it's so high that you wouldn't be able to move your finger over and you would just 
It's like hitting a fucking yeah, like, like a wall. wall. Yeah, a wall of wheel. So uh, that's what they. That's why they lowered it. And if you can see here, it's pretty darn. Arc zero two is not great at focusing up close, guys. It, she's struggling. And then here you can see it's much more square and proud. Yeah. But yeah, if you like the EC2, give the Outset a try. Outset AX, sorry. Yeah. I always get Vaxi's naming weird. Vaxi? Brand. Are they going to do a different Outset then? Theor the theoretically, they could. Yeah. It depends. Does Outset want to do? Who's Outset? Uh, a CSGO... Gamer. Legend, basically? Yeah, in from Asia. From Asia, okay. From I don't know where exactly in Asia. Okay. Um, but who's Vax? Or who's a... Great question. I asked That's you the other day, yeah. and you didn't know either. I don't know. I don't uh, know. We I, have to ask, I guess. I, I, are they the Japanese brand, or is Vaxi Japanese? Well. Oh, by the way, Lupin the Third Castle and Cagliostro came out in 4K, apparently. So I gotta, yeah. I gotta get that. This, this, does have, this does have a little bit of pre-travel on the, the OG Zygon here. Yeah, this is just a little. I mean, you can do it here, too. Easy, easy push, and then it does travel a little bit after. Just, but, okay. Yeah, Standard I mean, mouse. I mean, yeah, not not as bad as the Zoe, where it's like... Or try it, click, any of the other mice around here. Click, like the uh, Glorious that was around here. That's over there. The yeah, line. but like the, the clicks on these Vaxi mice are by far yeah. the most tuned. You want to something oddly though? You know I made all those different rival 106s? Yeah. Guess which one I use the most? The 20 mil? The 2.0. Yeah, the 2.0 <laughs> Yeah, I use the 2.0. I don't know why, I keep going back to them. I, yep, I apparently like a standard garbage you're switch. Just, you're, you're used to it apparently. Yeah, I'm just... I'm, and, this guy? Dude, if, if you want me to get massive headshots with an M14 in COD, yeah, just, just use just that, and I'm happy. There we go. That still has the uh, anti-double click. Yeah, it does. It's the first it. ones that had the anti-double click. I'm trying to sit back down with the chair. Oh, Zygon is run by Nopo, a former CS Pro. Like the keyboards. Uh, no, there's going to be one more O in Nopo, in the keyboard Nopo. Because aren't those the guys who did the Royal Clutch? If I recall correctly, the, that is the brand. Apparently, this Nopo yeah. is, and I think there's an extra O because this is N O P P O. I think Nopo and the other one N -O -P -P is N O P P O O. Or N O, -O. N -O P O O. I think. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So hmm. former CS Pro player, but yeah. So all of Vaxi stuff is going to be a combination between either an esports player yeah. or an esports brand. Um, you okay. know, like you might yeah. get like a Fnatic version or something. I mean, it's probably not Fnatic because they're they have their own mice. Yeah, they have their own mice because they, they bought a company. Up for they bought uh, Funk. Yep. Yeah, that's Good brand, cool. actually. Yeah. Um. But yeah, that's what that's what they're doing for all their shapes, and that's why you're seeing a lot of these older shapes. You see, like, when's the last time you saw a right-handed palm, or as they call tilt grip, yeah. mouse with the butt off the table? Like, like, see, it's, see, the butt doesn't go all the way down. The 403 from Logitech. I guess. I think that would be the last time I saw. Yeah, but that has the hump is much farther back on it, and then it basically sits in your hand. Hello, cat. Oh, we're overheating again on the RX02. So, well, do you want to crack open that glossy guy then? I think what we'll do is we will shoot a whole separate video on that. No, not shoot a whole separate video, but I'm going to stop this clip. Yeah, let it cool down. And we'll be right back. Stay tuned for literal second. Here, he's going to help us shots. with uh, reviews here. Um, and I, it's, it sounds like I'm converting squares over to glossy here. Glossy mice. Lance some mice. Because mice. He's, he's saying that the NP01G is better than the original. And you might even like that better than the, uh, the new coating, the new matte. I don't know about that. I think it, I think it definitely won't deteriorate i want to call this a like matte this? plastic yeah because there isn't a coating on here i think this is just straight just matte straight. matte plastic like like you know you, you you complained about uh oh crap what you didn't like the glossy white something and i'm like just sand it down because people do that on on reddit 
where they yeah. just sand off like it's still white yeah well they sand off the gloss coat that's what this seems like except uh i think it was the uh s2 i was gonna get that ah uh, uh, yeah because it only came gloss. in pink and blue originally yeah and you were like just, just sand her off yeah and then paint it I was like, I don't, I don't know about that. Well, guys, um, Hamlet wants attention, um, and he is pretty good about getting it. All right, well. Yeah. I was not going to go with that guy, then. And Squares was not going to go with this, but I bought one. Hee <laughs> hee. No, no, no. <laughs> But, after putting my hand on that guy. Uh, so he's going to steal it. No, 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 no. <laughs> uh, I, I don't know. I wouldn't steal it. I'd probably think about getting my own. Okay, you're taking up a lot of space here. All right. Maybe you should open this one. So All right. That one's, uh, um, the glossy's kind of you know, your thing. thing. I'll, I will do my best. All right. To keep if, it in if focus. It's boy, squares. All right. Or so, if I pause it. There we go. Don't worry, I do it all the time. And I just cut it in later using. I, I just mux the files together. Oh, all right. All right. I got a cat on my lap. Sorry about the. Rocking against the chair there. If you guys haven't seen any of my Pokemon polls, stopping over there, Hamlet makes quite a bunch of appearances. And you guys learn very quick that if even if he's here and he wants attention, yeah. he will just take it. Whether or not you give it to him. Yeah. Don't worry about it. That's cats. Well, hey, okay, so nice normally, cat. by the way, this should just be the G one and the normal one would be black. I don't Yeah. My only guess is they want white boxes because either it's what they had or it was cheaper. Yeah. Um either but or. the G right there. Means glossy. Also means white. With an extra whip at the. And you said it was yeah. that way because it shows less fingerprints. Yeah, they went with white because uh, they had complaints about other colors showing fingerprints. I could see that. On a thing yeah. that you grab with your fingers. Yeah. Uh, let's just clarify that. That I would yeah, assume yeah, yeah. anything that you grab with your fingers. It's gonna have fingerprints it's on. It's gonna have it. fingerprints on. Yeah. Put up a. Ooh. Look at that guy. Oh, by the way, I can tell you guys that these are generic boxes that Vaxi's buying from someplace. Like maybe a Bluetooth headphones, Bluetooth speaker, Bluetooth headset, and they're putting their foam in. Probably because they do not have enough volume to have their own custom boxes made. Because you wouldn't do this. This is expensive. Yeah. To make these little foamy inserts. You would much rather do like what Logitech and Razer on their cheap mice do, where they really bend that cardboard around it. Mm-hmm. And that's actually really secure, we found. Well, yeah. Razor's also doing that to reduce carbon footprint, I guess. Yeah. So I'm good on and it's them. it's cheaper. And yeah. Yeah, there's many reasons. Yep, I can definitely see that they have tried to... Okay, so here's the angly up of that cable. Mm-hmm. Here's the angly up of, of that one. Um, that degree... These are stonks. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And, and that, that is... That is, that is not stonks. I think that's how this works, right? Am I doing my like memes correctly? You got me, man. I, I don't know either. But I also like panda mice, so oh, yeah. I, I'm gonna have to tell Vaxi they made him. They made a. They made a great. The cable definitely is different from the standard. Yeah, listen to that yeah, guy. Okay. Listen to that. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah, the, the the front of it's higher. Mm -hmm. it, like like that's it, it's like you're like you got you got like one of those you like those try, uh, try that guy there. Get that out of the way. Still higher. Yeah. Higher front. Yep. It's like it's like if you took this guy and you went like. Well, I'm pretty certain from what I saw at least in their here, here. the measurements, like this side right here that sits under your index finger is noticeably higher. I think that might be where it is, is that. The there button, yeah, yeah that could a... potentially be, yeah, the, the button height <laughs> on the front of it too is less, like I said, less steep mm. on it. And I think that's what it is as well, as you're seeing basically like this is flatter. Yep. So it doesn't it's curve down as much. It's taller and flatter, yeah. 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 And then like I said, the butt. And then the I, butt chops off, yeah, it you just, can see. It doesn't, like where this, would this actually to be truthful this goes more towards my my fingertip claw yeah. or fingertip palm grip yeah. because this is resting mm -hmm. on the mouse pad this definitely goes more towards your top 
palm grip because it purposely, with this butt chopped off, mm -hmm. keeps your the back end of your palm here off of the mouse I mean, didn't they also say it was like, so you could basically maneuver your hand if you're going like this without it, the uh, palm of the mouse basically yeah, they, cutting into your palm and forcing exactly. you to move your whole arm. Yep. So we'll have to see. The only way for me to know if I'm going to like this, like, okay, shape-wise, I like it already. Yeah. But because I want to put my... Your whole hand on it, basically. Palm on the desk. Yeah. And it doesn't do it. Um, you can't do that with that, huh? Yeah, I can't do that. So we'll see if I like it. I mean, like, in the way of, like, I'm used to using this. Like, you see, I, my hand goes on here, and I'm just like, mm -hmm. oh, it's this real nice. Yeah. Yeah. Um, this, this, this is pretty nice, too. This, by the way, slopes down way faster. Yeah. Like... That one's, I feel like, flatter overall, and it is smaller. Yeah. Oh, how does it compare, compared to that one, length, like lengthwise? This. Yeah, I mean, are they pretty much identical? It, it's actually a little longer. Is it? Yeah. And a little bit more button overhang though. Uh, yeah. And it's it's, it's longer more... in both ways. Okay. Um, so, yeah, the the, the new uh, outside is actually pretty short. Like it's, it's a. It's a... Yeah, but it, it definitely fills up the palm. Yeah, she's tall. Yeah. She's got some legs. Wait, no. Actually, it does have bigger mouse feet. It's got 0. 0.6 yeah. standard rather than... It doesn't come with the 0. 0.3, 0. 0.4. 4, 5, I thought it was. Point, I... Something along those lines. Yeah, but taller mouse feet. Um... You know, that does... This feels... Oh, oh. Uh, feels like kind of a... A, it's gonna, so an in between. Feels better. No, 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 it's gonna be like a, a an in between of like the 403. Yeah. It's like they took parts like the the, the higher palm rest on the 403, and then they kind of like chopped off its butt, brought it down more, and then it still made it curvy. I don't know. It's, 403 was kind of bulbous. So I, yes. I feel this is like a slim, definitely slim. And the other thing was like the sensor in that was like offset that mm -hmm. they had for it then, so you had to kind of hold it weird. I mean, you get used to it, but yeah, it's one of the things that I saw like people were complaining about was just like yeah. why you another, have to hold it weird. If you guys are wondering, another benefit if you're into like you know we have both of the new vaccine mice, same mouse feet. What a brand can use the same feet on two different mice? Huh. Who would have thought? Who would have thunk? Yeah. Are these the thicker feet too, these or are no? The thinner. These are the you thinner. You can feel them. Feel basically. them. They're much. Closer to the yeah to the surface itself the versus that where there's actually kind of like a speed oh yeah like a speed bump a yep. little bit yeah so I wonder what, what Zoe use these things just feel like a they're thick boys could chunk yeah if you look though they're not flat too because you were you were asking yeah. the one time about like why does wear look all weird or like is because your heart bed no it's yeah. just because the feet on Zoe are like cupped in yeah so they wear on the outside first before yeah. they wear on the inside it's like um, the the rival. Yeah, and if you ever start that... wearing the inside of your Zoe feet, that's actually how you know that they're worn out, which is, like, gotcha. weird because once you put third-party aftermarket feet on it, which yeah. I've only done once because yeah. I didn't have extra feet at the time, now I have Zoe feet out the wazoo. Um, there was Zoe, like, like third-party feet, like, say so you go get some cast feet, those are completely flat. Yeah. And you're like, wow, this slide's, like... Butter? Uh, but yeah. Yeah. Who'd have known? Yeah. Ticasta. It's still way better than, uh, what was it, the EC2... Beefy, the little tiny. Oh, I like those though. Ugh. I mean, they give you a ton of them. <laughs> you get like twelve of them or something like that in the box, so you can you can replace those feet like three times. So maybe they're saying something. Awful. Yeah, it doesn't slide at all. Like maybe no? for you who uses uh, it's a cloth bed. It's cloth bed. Yeah. For anybody who uses like a hard or a plastic I or so get pinched. Desk. Why would you use your desk, man? People do what people want to do. I mean, I, I feel like if you're gonna be serious about your your video video games, though, you'd want to use a you're gonna use a, glass a decent desk. surface glass like, desk, glass yeah. desk. <laughs> so and then it's not gonna glass track glass. at all, yeah. <laughs> Unless you're using like Logitech's whatever dark field laser. And you can even see here. Look, the the cable wants to go yeah up and out up yeah. And then and because they designed this, and even with this one they did, but it just you can feel there's like more. Even yeah. though this is a soft cable, it's got some stiffness to it. Yeah. And I talked about that. Because they want it to, like, say if you train it, they want you to be able to train it. So say if you want it to go right there, mm. it it'll learn to go right there, and it'll stay there. You know, and then the reason why I also with that is, oh, oh, there I choke. Mm -hmm. Get that. Here I choke. 
Um, hey, it, they have one molded in. Yeah. Ferret choke. So if these guys can put ferret chokes in their mice, other brands, bigger, more expensive brands, should be able to put ferret chokes. Cause you, uh, okay, I don't know if you, have you ever guys have ever gotten that weird noise where it goes when I'm gonna you move your like mouse? A, I'm gonna sound like a troll speaker. here. Yeah. What if they were wireless though? Yeah, you don't need fear head chokes there, Elliot. What about Just, when you have to charge it? I mean, most people use it. Use it I plugged suppose. In. I, why would you use it plugged in when it's charging? I don't I know. Mean, because people are crazy. Like you just use the you, you know what? by the razor stuff yeah, and you know get the charging I tell dock. Is yeah, that's why you get the dock. Yeah. And then when you're done with it, yeah, you, you put it on the dock. I mean, you could do it that way, yeah. Or if you, like, you buy the Logitech stuff, another thing you could do is just get the magnetic ones that you got, and then just leave the magnet in the front of the mouse, and then magnetically charging. You could do that with the uh, Aerox 3. It's got Type-C. Type C, yeah. Yeah, you can get Type-C. Yeah, to whatever, and then just do it that way, yeah. And then, then you dock the connector to it. Yeah, you create. Because there's no way, there's no place to put the 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 dongle. The dongle. So yeah. You just plug it. You just plug it right in the front. That's what yeah. I do with that. That's that's screws with mine. Screws pro tip. He's just yeah. like, hey, you just put it right there. Yeah. Where else are you supposed to put it? And also, he's got an antenna. I mean, the, the dongle's huge though. <laughs> it's like this. It's bigger than that. All right. It is. Hey, we is, got a dongle for our mouse, like, and it's Type C. What yeah. the hell, man? All the others are basically like this. We pull this cap off. This size, but they aren't Type C. Not Steel Series. <laughs> well, let's just make it fucking ginormous. All right. Don't you remember cool. Steel Series old, older ones though? They always put it in the dock. Yeah. So it's like, here's your wire. Like you want to use it with your laptop. Yeah. Here's your wireless dongle. Toof. Yeah. Don't worry about it. I wonder what they're gonna do with the next ones. Cause isn't the Aerox Five supposed to be a, a Rival Six Hundred clone? I mean, well, you're the one. You're means, the one who likes the. I like the Rival 600. Yeah, the Rival 600. That's so like, good mouse. That's gonna be like I, I wore one of those out. Yeah, you wore the rubber <laughs> off the side. <laughs> They're crying out loud. That's a problem with Steel Series, though. I think they don't know how to attach their fucking grips. Yeah. Actually, I've talked about this design before. Mm -hmm. For only purely aesthetic reasons. Mm -hmm. On the fingers here, they split it where your fingers are. Mm -hmm. Had they not done that, it wouldn't fall off. Because this side, where your thumb is, yeah. it does not fall it's off. one whole piece, basically. One whole piece. Yeah. If they would have just made this side one whole piece, it wouldn't have fallen off. I mean, maybe, maybe not. There's, Probably there's, it would not have fallen off. There's, there's images I've seen of, like, the Rival 310, where that's got the silicone grips. That's really people, just... Yeah, it just... Wear a hole into it. No, no, no. This one, basically, the whole silicone grip came off. Somebody posted on, I think it was Probably Reddit. Probably a bad piece of Yeah. My, the thing I always see about the original Rival... Like OG yeah. rival, like the first, you know, like with the nice squishy side grip. Like, is that the rival three hundred now? Yeah, I think it's the rival three hundred. Yeah. Um, where they wear a hole basically yeah, yeah, into yeah. the side of the grip, and I'm like, yeah. are you he? Oh, here, here, take a look at that. Yeah, it's already. Ooh, you probably cool. need to focus. Look and at you're that. No, you can see it. You can see some of the gloss on there. Oh yeah, beautiful. So, you know, you guys, you guys, they were complaining because, you know, they get complaints about fingerprints about on the other colors of glossy other than white. Yeah. What about palm prints yeah, that's, on the black one? That's what I have a feeling. Um, it's going to be nice initially and then give it a few months and it's just going to be gross. By the way, this is exactly what my Zoe mask look like. Like the, like the, the, the non-glossy ones? Yeah. That's terrible. Yeah, but that's yeah. like just untreated plastic, isn't it? Uh, that's that basically what, what this feels like. Yeah. Ah yeah, well, it'll just absorb all the oils in your hand and. Yep, yeah, but that like look through. at that like that. Yeah, what was that like? Three like seconds. Three seconds of <laughs> hands on. Now be aware, guys. I have super like acidic greasy sweat. and acidic sweat. So you so. say you're basically just a, a xenomorph. I don't, I don't know. Only it's sweat. I don't know if some of you probably also have this where you have a, like, ever touch the soft touch yeah, mice? This. And it's like your, your, oh, man. your sweat glands just open up and just start pouring. And I just, I'm one of the people that wears the old school soft touch, you know, like the spray on. Yeah. Actually, like, soft to the touch. That poor guy. Soft touch off. It's probably a good thing you got the glossy one. <laughs> All right, we're back. Sorry, 
My All bad. right, guys. Do you see how similar these things are, though? Like, from, from the back side, I can barely... Try to focus, and I failed. Try again. All right. Sometimes there it focuses on human. But, yeah, I was like, oh, oh, which, 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 which one's what? Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. They look so similar. They do. I will say, uh, kind of oddly, the grip here feels very similar in the width. Mm -hmm. Like in in the the, the pinchy part, oh, that's mm -hmm. what I call it. Like between your thumb and your like right there. The grip area. Yeah, that feels like nigh on identical. Yeah, I mean it wasn't like terrible. I don't think it, no. the problem was it was. Well, my problem with that mouse is I would bump the four button. Yeah. And you see I this don't time. I feel like with the glossy variant of it though, because you don't have to grip it as much. I bet you you'll probably have a better experience with that one versus the stock coating, because it does seem like it, it grabs better in certain ones. I'm just pointing this out that my, my thumb is hitting the four button without. Well, I don't know what to tell you then, man. I have a fat. Okay. Um, uh, I have a fat right thumb, guys. Yeah. I, I do, because writing. What happens is I get callus on it, so my like, my right thumb is like actually bigger than my left thumb because it gets calloused from. I think we're cooking right now. I see a little. I see a little icon. Yep. Yep. We're overheating. We're cooking and, this. We're cooking this poor little camera. Um. But yeah. So that that's why my my right thumb like with mousing like where say Squeers' thumb will fit in there fine. I mean, not really. It's not really it, fine. Well, you know It's what still I, there. I mean, it's. Or like, or like Preston's too. Like sometimes you'll hold my thumb, my right thumb up to his right thumb. Like yeah. where I'll be complaining, oh, I don't have enough room. He's like, it's fine. And it's like my thumb's just like, yeah. Kaboof. Mine's definitely like all I'd have to do is roll it, and I would definitely actuate that button, which is, I don't like that. The constant like, on that. Yeah. There we go. Yeah, this one's much better. Like you definitely have more more comfort there. So, oh, just ripping off a hangnail, guys. It's fine. Don't worry about it. I've got a bunch right here in the stomach. You can see it in that area. You don't need yeah. to take video of that. But... Oh, okay. And I cut myself there, too. Look at it. That's, that's what you don't do with a knife. Why are you doing that? I didn't do that right now. Look, it's old. It's, like, already half healed. Yeah. How long ago was that? Uh, who knows? I probably did something that I wasn't supposed to, and it slipped or... Hurting yourself again? I see how it is. Or that might have been packaging, too. Yeah. Because, like, if you look at how that is, if I'm cutting, yeah. there's no way I should be able to slice, like... Yeah. It's essentially that way. Just bring all these guys in here. And it's just. It's, it's like this guy's out of the. He doesn't yeah. fit. Yeah. Can I get out okay, of here. Let's, uh... let's get out of here, black mouse. Oh, God. Oh, God. We're, getting, uh, we're getting flagged. See you uh, later. We got, we got panda mice here. They're mixed. I guess. Mixed, uh, I guess. Mixed race. Don't worry. I, I want the black man copy. It's going to be good times. This, this mouse still feels good. Yeah. It does, honestly. Like, I don't think you can ever truly recreate that You know what I still play shape. better than with this, though? Uh, the Rival 106. Death Adder. Rival 106. Rival 106. Yep. I don't even I don't even use my 106 now. We did all that customization for it to put the Kale 4.0s in there and paracorded the thing. And yeah. now I'm like, I don't even want to touch it. It just, it's so, it's so beautiful. Got to put some grips on it, too. Seriously, grip the grips. Yeah. Ah. Uh, isn't that glossy on the top though? Yes. And then it's like rough plastic on the sides. It, That's perfect. It is, is basic. No, it's not rough plastic on the sides. I mean, isn't it like? It's not glossy plastic. It's like it's like this it's or like that. Like that, that. Or like that plastic. But I'm going to know. point this out that people think I'm crazy for just putting uh, grips on the clicks. Yeah. See, see right here. But look at what Vaxi's doing. They rough plastic. Texturing the area. Just the grip, on yeah. the click area. It's like I know maybe maybe I know something or two. Yeah. Or three. Though uh, everybody says I should put grips on the grip area. So what you're saying is Vaxi. He's gonna be waiting for the royalty check. Thank you very much. <laughs> uh that just reminds me of when I was on the keyboard layout and then somebody actually used it. Yeah, that was the keyboard layout that I have on my cooler master, the TK. Yeah. I was like, this is it. And you're like, I designed that. And I'm like, I don't know about that. And you're like, I did. Yeah. There it is. And oh, I was like, well. I actually have it dated. It's a, a year before. Oddly, right yeah. within a year before it came out. You know about yeah. how long it takes to yeah. get a product to market? Oops. About a year. I'm tossing that mouse off the table. And, it, and actually, it wasn't uh, Cooler Mask that did it first. It's the Chinese OEM that makes it for them. Yeah. Because they actually had their own keyboard out first. Mm -hmm. 
But it turns out when random Chinese OEMs try and sell things. Not that good? Well, not many people buy them because they're like, oh, who's that man? Yeah. Who's Xing, Xing Shua? I. Maybe, long, maybe, maybe Jing Shua is amazing. Yeah, I, it's probably the same guys who did the Royal Kludge keyboard. Still, uh, still one of my favorites. Mine got taken taken away from me. Yeah, I mean, it wasn't intentional. No. But you know, I still have mine. I just it's got to let her air out for a while. That's all. Yeah. Um, if if you guys like Death Adder, EC2, um, D or D minus, um, IME 3.0. Right-handed, and if, as Vaxi would say, t tilt grip, I call Log it. Logitech 403, can't forget that. Yeah. Um, I feel like that's probably... The closest to this, yeah. That, that. and then the Logitech 403. Because the raised front buttons. It's yep. definitely very... Far, but if, if you were wondering, like, say you wanted to, like, you're an EC2 guy. Mm -hmm. And you're like, I want to try Vaxi, because, you know, they're totally not Zoe. Um, try the... Totally not Zoe. Totally not Zoe. Try the outset. I would say AX to be exact. Yeah. Who knows? Maybe they'll change it. Maybe it'll be A-Y. Yeah, that's where my brain went to. A-Z. Who knows? And that'll be the big one. That'll be like the EC1. Oh, it's got a new connector, doesn't it? What? Is that the same Vaxi connector? No, no, no. Yeah, yeah. No, that's, uh... That's, that's the idea. That's this one. No, it's this... That's the outset. You need this one right here. That's that guy. Come on, Matt. Oh, yeah, look at that. It does have the, the weird little logo on there. Oh, this is it, too. Huh. I guess I just never looked at. Never mine. noticed at some of the minor details, basically. <laughs> uh, it's like we we don't review things around here. I mean, we do, but you know, we just I guess don't go that in depth into every little. Oh, uh, this is one thing though that Vaxi fixed. This is what makes me think Razer OEMs it too. Yeah, the little is, rubber. But look, they made it reusable because it stays attached to the cable. I think uh, Razer does that with their keyboards if i remember correctly they might have updated but all their mice are still like where you pull it off and yeah. it goes twang and flies halfway across the room I'm pretty certain they're uh the razor huntsman te uh mm -hmm. has a rubber connector like that i'm pretty yeah, darn there's, certain there's more tension on here yeah than there is what about this guy you, you hear the pin the what about, pitch yeah okay listen listen lower higher yeah. I'm gonna try this guy. I mean, these sound pretty similar. A little lower, but it's pretty close. Yeah, there's still more tension down here. Yeah. Than there is. They increased it. It's. I don't think it's any more clicky. Necessarily? It doesn't feel any more tactile. Basically. No, but there's more tension here, and they yeah. lowered it, so you don't like. Yeah. Like this one, you can really run your finger into. Yeah. Makes it easier to click, but I, in a way too, I guess it makes it harder because you can't just slip your finger on top of it. Yeah. You have to like. Oh, uh, like... by the way, both of these mice. If you're a three finger person. Yeah. Both of the vaccine mice are actually good candidates. Like you have plenty of room. You can't do that in the Zoe. Feels, it gets feels a little kinda, awkward. Yeah, because it's more swoopy. What about this guy? Uh, no. Not Too at skinny. All. That's, Unless okay. he was, Unless he he was a smaller hand. hand yeah. Like, eh. yeah, if you get like a. But no, it's like, like baby hand. The Vaxies, like if you if you are a three finger, like they make the front wider. That accommodates. Yeah. Three finger. I'm not a three finger. Person. Same. No. I think the closest I got was the uh, the five eighteen from Logitech. That was the... Um, like, when you use, like, the boom sling or some other razors, you have to use yeah. three finger. Um, the little Lucasa or whatever it is. Yeah, and, and I've, says, I've done the, I've used it. those before. Yeah. But, um, like, I wouldn't choose, like, on a, say, a, a mouse, I, like, say, EC2. Mm -hmm. Like, I'm not going to force it into a three finger mm -hmm. mouse. That just feels... Yeah, I don't think it's designed for that, basically. No. But this one, especially how flat it is, the, the MPG, MP01. Yeah. Like you could very easily three finger this if you're into that. Yeah. Um, yeah, we're gonna plug. The, I'm gonna plug this in. Um, maybe not tonight because we got some Pokemon polls coming up. Yep. Check check those out. Check out our Pokemon polls. I also should have for like a month. Um, uh, what is it? Mad Minute Mouse Madness. Uh oh. What happened? There we go. 
Um, it might still be focused on squares. I don't know. Well, uh, the uh, camera overheated. Y- yeah! yeah. I, Sony cameras like to do that. Um, especially when we ignore the warnings that they give you. My bad. <laughs> it's all right. Um, but, uh, yeah, I think we like the outset. We're going to give it a shot. I think. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Maybe come back with some ideas and thoughts later on. Kind of like how I did with the Vaxi mm-hmm. after, or the Zygon NP01 after one good night of playing. Uh, oh, I found some issues with me personally. You know, just my compatibility with it. Um, it's otherwise. Kind of, it's kind of small and kind of skinny, yeah. Um, it's not a bad mouse, but I mean, it just didn't no. fit my play style. Build quality is like immaculate. Honestly. Yeah. Uh, especially on the glossy one. Yeah, Woo! They, yeah, they, build, they build a good product. That's um, but yeah, so check out their stuff. Uh, basically only available through them, from my understanding. Mm-hmm. And uh, we'll see you in the next video. And we got it right this time. It's uh, Mad Minute Mouse Madness? Mania. Mania. Yeah. Mad Minute Mouse Mania. Check, a, check Squares and I going through mice at like a review every couple minutes. Um, I post one of those every other day or so. You'll probably see them still when this is going up because I space them out because we don't need like mouse, 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 mouse. It'd be a month of mice because we did that many. Mouse review channel. Yeah. That's what we are. Um, and Pokemon Pulse. Yeah. <laughs> Check out that stuff. Um, that's where we're up to next. See you in the next one. Which one is which one, my guys? Well, I mean... That for sure is the standard EX. That could be an MP01. No, is it <laughs> outset right there? <laughs> I mean, if you put that, no, yeah. even then you can tell because of the the logo and like it's gray, versus that where it's more of like a black. I wonder if they're gonna update that. I bet you they have already, possibly. Yeah, there's a good chance. Let me put like Zion yeah, these here. two. The Panda glossy. Yeah. Apart from like looking at the side of it, or, yeah. Damn. It's, it's... Just wait till I have both those on my desk. <laughs> Rip.